This Manual Plus item is designed to supplement the WGI Adjudication Manual and Rulebook for intended use by WGI judges, WGI's circuit partners, and their judge associations. During caption conversations at the 2013 Color Guard Advisory Board meeting, instructors addressed a certain forgiveness in commentary requirements that impact the individual analysis captions of movement and equipment, with particular emphasis on the movement caption. Instructors are willing to hear less formal terms and judge speak in order to know their skills are being acknowledged. We've noticed a pattern of lapses in commentary in the presence of skills that cannot be easily categorized. The fear is that this lapse in commentary is an indicator of a lapse in acknowledgement and reward for these hard to describe skills. With easily described skills being given disproportionate weight purely on the basis of their ease of description. In essence, some feel that the credit is not being given to some skills because they cannot be named within the traditional ballet lexicon. In this study, instructors volunteered samples of hard-to-describe skills assembled into a phrase. I've extracted the audio of these samples in order to help focus the study. Some of these videos are a bit pixelated by virtue of how they were captured and then exchanged. They still work for the function of this session, but some will actually be easier to see on your personal electronic devices rather than this large screen of the group presentation. Make sure to go the educational player as a follow-up to this session and to work at your own pace. Before we begin, remember that almost all descriptives can capture a movement skill or quality. Let's warm up by looking at the implied movement in these silks and come up with single word descriptives. Given this heightened tolerance, it might be smart to record your commentary during the initial viewing just to establish your marker for eventual growth. Then, after listening and assessing your own patterns, see where this loosening of commentary requirements can actually help you see and say more in order to better reflect the challenges and achievements of the phrases. Remember that this focus on language is actually the gateway to greater awareness, with greater recognition, acknowledgement, and potential reward being the primary objective. This shift in language is merely the means to that end. If you're a WGI judge, seek and follow the process prescribed by Beverly before your first viewing. Okay, here we go.
Though we've shifted our guidelines in terms of commentary, remember that your commentary is still our first indicator of accountability. Don't confuse the loose intolerance of terminology with the freedom to work out of caption philosophy. As you continue to work to increase your awareness, we're sure you'll find that balance. Thank you.